Hello, and welcome to Pokemon TCG Daily Booster Pack 259. Battle Trainers, I hope you're having a fantastic Monday wherever you are. Today we're opening up a Sun and Moon Forbidden Light Pokemon Booster Pack, so let's go ahead and get started. But in case you're brand new to my channel, I've been opening up one Pokemon Booster Pack every single day now for well over 250 days straight. With each and every single video, I like to try to hand out two QR codes for the online Pokemon trading card game. The steps to receive a code from me personally are to like this video, subscribe if you're brand new, answer my unique Pokemon question of the day that I include at the end of every single video, and then provide some way to, for me to get in contact with you personally. This can be an Instagram account, Twitter account, uh, email account, any way that I can uh, personally get in contact with you and try to get out this code or one of the other codes I have laying around into a few people from the comments down below. Uh, hopefully by the time I get this video out, I'm actually recording this video late uh, Sunday night the night before. Um, I just had a fantastic, fantastic weekend filled with Pokemon events and stuff, um, and I hope to talk about that a little bit. I'm actually going to do, I think I'm going to really push and try to do a deck analysis video, um, but I'm going to go ahead and jump into the content today's booster pack and kind of wrap up those other thoughts I have, but let's go ahead and see what we have in this booster pack first, and then I'll go get back to those thoughts in just a second. Uh, we kick things off with a Steel-type Energy, followed by that we have a Gabite, uh, Gabite, Garchomp, Cynthia, that's kind of the deck I'm leaning towards, actually towards in, um, in standard format, right? Right now i'll actually talk about that a little bit in a different video uh next we follow things up with the supporter card bonnie right there after that we have the grass type pokemon antler look a cool looking fellow right there go goat uh, followed up by that, we have the, I think he's also a poison type Pokemon too, but we have a, a fighting type of Crow Gunk right there. Next, we follow things up with psychic type Pokemon Esper. After that, we have the bunny type Pokemon Bunnelby. Next, we have one of my favorite, actually, Gen 6 Pokemon. I think the concept of a sword being a Pokemon is an absolutely great idea. We have a Hone Edge right there. Uh, getting towards the end here, we have an Execute. And our cards, cool cards in this booster pack, we have a Reverse Hollow. I'm going to probably butcher this name just a little bit. A Dan. A dead Denny, that's what I'm gonna go with. And the last card, we have a Lycan Rock, so that's actually pretty cool. I've seen this card used a little bit, um, but nothing exciting in that Pokemon booster pack. But for today's question of the day, you know, this is uh, this is a fun one. I actually just want to know, uh, what spin-off Pokemon game do you guys play? Are you guys still on board with Pokemon Go? I happened to have my uh, Poke Watch when I was actually playing Pokemon Go a little bit uh, uh, a little bit more actively about a year ago. I still do hop onto it from the time to time. But any of the spin-off Pokemon games, Mystery Dungeon, uh, the Pokemon Coliseum, so there's a lot of other good good ones. That's the, today's question of the day. But as I was saying, I have actually kind of like a bonus round, just kind of some of the cool cards I got this weekend from going to League. I got some really cool leagues stamps one i was able to get a beast ring a celestial steela uh a celeste steela sorry it's really late as i'm making this one i got a promo rare candy and probably the coolest ones of uh, the reverse hall bubbles so it was really cool and i managed at the one store i went to i managed to get two um these are actually uh, from heart and gold sold silver uh copycats and these are actually legal to use again i'm absolutely not going to use one of these and i also got a malamar as well like I said, uh, as the time I'm, I'm making this video, I hope to be doing a deck analysis video. I'm really uh, ready to share my deck that I'm uh, trying to use in expanded format. I'm actually really, really happy with the list. As far as decks go, it is the best deck I have made personally myself. So hopefully by the time this video goes up, I just kind of want to include this here because there's other things I will be kind of talking a little bit about how my matches went and stuff this weekend. And I was really hoping to have a live stream pushed out. I, I kind of figured out how to use OBS and all the uh, video capture software, but there's a couple things I have to do to make sure my internet can work really really well and when I when I say it this time I really mean it I am super close to be doing my first live stream but fellow trainers just hang on there a little bit longer I hope to have another bonus video put out before the end of the day and show off my deck a little bit fellow trainers I hope you're having a great day wherever you are and I will see you tomorrow as always